Here we have a 6 to 8 plate Mercedes Benz A250 AMG line Premium Plus. Now, this vehicle comes with the LED headlights. We have the Pan America front grille with the black Mercedes badge in the center. We also have the front splitter as well. The Cosmos black metallic exterior paintwork. We then have the 18 inch gloss black alloy wheels, all of which in excellent condition and unmarked. You'll also find we have color coded door handles and door mirrors, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass at the rear. Up top you'll find the panoramic glass sunroof that's currently open. You can also get put onto a tilt. We then have the A35 style rear spoiler sitting nice and aggressive. We do also have front and rear parking sensors with a rear reversing camera. Round to the back you'll find the quad tip exhaust with the rear diffuser. And if you take a look inside of the boot, just open it up just like so. You'll find we have a decent amount of space inside of here. Taking a closer look inside, you'll be able to see just there. We also have the hooks on either side, partial shelf at the top and handles either side on top where we can pull the boot back down. Back round to the driver's side, you'll then find the vehicle is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. So if we take a look at the interior, inside of the back first, you'll find the half leather seats, we have the red stitching, we also have the foldable armrest and the fixed ISO points as well back here, electric windows on the doors. Take a look at the front, you'll find the same half leather seats, as a look at the roof as well. Both these front seats are also heated and they're also electrically adjustable with the memory functions controlled here on the doors. Electric windows with child lock for the rear, electric mirrors as well. The automatic lights down here, multifunctional steering wheel, what's more with the red stitching. Taking the seat inside now, you'll find the digital dashboard here in front of us. If you put a foot on the brake, press the start button, then the vehicle will start up. Just so make sure the volume's turned down. We've got the phone connectivity there on the left hand side, along with paddle shifters either side, cruise control and speed meter on the right. Digital dashboard, free from any warning lights. We do also have the main infotainment screen. It's currently showing the sat nav, but plenty of features on here. We have the touchpad along with the shortcut buttons either side to go through them quickly. You'll find we have the radio stations, we also have the media options, Bluetooth phone connectivity as well for the phone calls. Then onto the main menu, we can scroll through all the other features quickly just like so. If we go on to comfort, you'll find the ambient lighting where we have plenty of colours to choose from. It's inside of the vents, it also runs across the dashboard and across the doors. It looks really nice, especially at night time. We also have the seat kinetics just there as well. Again, moving further over, you'll find we have the apps just here. Further down though, you'll find the climate control, the ice cold air conditioning, gloss black trim here in the centre. Open this up to find some storage space along with the two cup holders. We also have the switch just here for the different drive modes so you find eco, comfort, sport and individual. Putting the car into reverse, you then find the reversing camera with the parking sensors on the right, back into park and then finally we have the lever RMS just here which can be opened up for extra storage. That's all I'm going to show you guys today though. If you'd like to find out more, please check out the website. This vehicle comes to a fresh service, a fresh MOT and free nationwide delivery. Thank you for watching. Video test drive of this Mercedes-Benz A250 AMG Line Premium Plus. Now the purpose of the video test drive is to show the vehicle that drives as you expect it to. As you can see, I'd like to fire the steering wheel to keep it in a straight line, not veering off to the left or to the right hand side, staying straight on true. Now we're doing the multifunction steering wheel, which has the paddle shifters either side. If you want to set the car into money mode, simply tap on the paddles to change gear. Now we are just approaching a junction, so we're slowing down. We've got our right indicator on. Wait for this car to go past. Some more coming, so let's wait for them to go as well. It's now safe to turn right, so we're continuing on our way. And then we'll get up to speed, nice and smoothly, with the automatic gearbox. We have the cruise control and speed buttons here on the right hand side. Digital dashboard as well in front of us. If you do listen carefully, throughout the video test drive, you'll also notice you'll be free from any unwanted knocks or bangs. We do have the half leather seats as well, which are really comfortable. You can easily do two, three, or even 400 miles in this vehicle. Still get out feeling really fresh. Both front seats being heated, so also perfect for them cold winter mornings. We do have plenty more features throughout the interior. We've got the panoramic glass sunroof just up there. We also have ambient lighting, which runs all throughout the interior. 
really makes it a nice place to be. We then have the main attempt screen, it's currently showing the sat nav, but also has plenty more features on there you would have seen on the photos, for example the DAB radio and Bluetooth phone connectivity. Now we are just about to take a, another right hand turn, so we put our right indicator on, we to slow down and then turning right onto Roby Road and again accelerating, getting up to speed nice and smoothly with the automatic gearbox. We also have the different drive modes as well in this vehicle, which you can switch between using this switch down here. We are just approaching the bend, so we're going to slow down, make our way around the bend, and then coming up to the dealership, put our left indicator on, and turning our left onto the dealership, and then I will perform an emergency stop now in three, two, and one. Hard onto the brakes, put the car into reverse, reverse camera appears on the screen, back into drive now with no issues whatsoever. Now if this video has answered all your questions then please feel free to get in contact with our sales team where they can answer all and answer questions along with one of some inquiries of you. That's all for me today though. Cheers.